But to us, the devil has fallen. Fear none, child of God. I say fear none. I say fear not. I say fear none. I say fear not. The devil has fallen. In the book of Isaiah chapter 14, verse 12. Listen to this. How have you fallen from heaven? So we are speaking about someone from the family here. Not someone from outside. I will ascend above the heights of the cloud and I will make myself like the most high. This is the reason why Lucifer was, was kicked out from heaven. Why? Number one, because he wanted to be like the most high God. Any person who calls himself God is committing blasphemy. He's like his brother, Lucifer. Yet you shall be brought down to hate. Even if you want, no, 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 you shall be brought down to the innermost recess of the pit, the region of the dead. And this is what I'm telling you. Lucifer knows his destiny. That his destiny is the pit of hell is hate. But does not want to go there alone. Refuses to go there alone. Want to bring many people. Want to bring captives. I am taking you away from the plans of the devil. You are not going to the hates. In the mighty name of Jesus. Number 15. Yet you shall be brought down to Shuel. To the innermost recess of the pit. The region of the dead. Number 16. Those who see you will gaze at you and consider you. And will consider saying, Is this the man who made the earth tremble? Who shook kingdoms? Number 17, very critical. Who made the world like wilderness and overthrow its cities? Who will not permit his prisoners to return home? I'm breaking news to you that the Antichrist, the devil himself, Lucifer, does not keep prisoners. He does not allow them to go back home, but he takes them with to the haze. He takes them to Take them with to the pit. I am bringing you to the real Christ. To the hope of glory. To the I am God. To Yahweh. To the bread of life. To the water of life. To the springs of living waters. And to confirm what I've just said. He knows he's waiting for judgment. Jude 1, he says, An angel who did not keep care of God and hold to their own first place of power, but abandoned their proper dwelling place. He did not keep his place. Pride became a problem. You were given authority, you were given dominion to rule. You wanted more. This he has reserved in custody, in internal chains, bonds, under the thick gloom of utter darkness until the judgment and doom of great day there was power that given and this is the same power that the devil is using but it's limited but abandon their proper dwelling place this he has reserved in custody he is chained under the thick gloom of utter darkness in darkness until the judgment and doom of great day comes so when great tribulation comes, when Jesus Christ comes with the white horse, with the armies of heaven destroying the triple six and the beast, it will be the end of Lucifer. Until then, Lucifer, he is in this world. But worry not, heaven and earth shall pass away, but my ways will never pass away.